Yeah, we fucking doing it. Yeah, we're fucking jungle beats. Uh, we're Australians if you haven't fucking realised already. Uh, this is me fucking cunt right here, fucking Sandy. But I would, and uh, I'm the fucking head cunt of the fucking cunts, mistress the school cunters. And my fucking name's uh, Dusty. Dusty fucking cunto. That's right, people call me cunto for short. But you can call me Dusty cunt. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, we've decided to uh, review, uh, do this new segment, and we are, we are, oh, fuck, what is it, Macca? Oh, fuck off, Macca, I don't got no fucking durries. <laughs> Go down the fucking road. Yeah, fucking here we got some. Oh, fuck off, Macca, you fucking cunt. <laughs> fucking hell, Macca fucking always trying to fucking get, oh, fuck me, mate. Anyways, we've got a... Uh, you know, we're starting this new fucking segment where we're fucking uh, reviewing different fucking uh, areas of the fucking world, you know, because we're fucking Australians, you know, we fucking don't go do fucking shit, mate. Oh, we fucking just fucking. Ah, fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> <All right. laughs> anyway, I, I think I, you voted Gaskin, man. <laughs> <laughs> I think you fucked it. <laughs> I think, <laughs> I think I, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think that's good. That's all right. I think I'll get uh, the message. No, I'll fight. <laughs> Anyways, we're Jungle Beats. What's your real name, mate? Australia's plugged to the worst intros in the country. <laughs> um, my name is Alexander Sandalis. I've already given you mine. Yep. It's, still, it's, it's my real name. Still the same. <laughs> now, if you don't understand Australian, um, what that means is we're just going to review uh, a new segment, different countries around the world. We're, we're gonna... starting a new segment. And um, I'm gonna, I want to show him one. I've heard this one, but I want to show him because I, oh, of what because I, I thought it was just outstanding, and this artist. You know, could have a lot of potential uh, for the future of our series and, and music in general. Her name is um, Rosalia. R Rosalia. Uh, she's Spanish. We're going to review. Oh. This is a Spanish song. Do you know there's a Pokemon called Rosalia? Really? Oh, no, Rosalia. Oh. Good Pokemon, though. Grass Poison. Uh, good special defense. Pretty good special attack. Uh, evolves into Rose Raid. First evolution is Budju. Yeah, don't fuck with Rose Raid's fucking dope, man. Did you say it was outstanding? Did you ever find a track in standing? <laughs> <laughs> I also liked the last time we did that, uh... Oh! You know, when I said Slowpuff's a Pokemon and you put Slowpuff on the yeah. screen? The gif. That was fucking dope. I'm, yeah. I'm gonna do that for this one. Yeah, gonna find a Ros Roselia just gif where Roselia's like... Yeah. Anyway, man, she's a dope artist. I got introduced to... Uh, I got introduced through uh, Rosalia through Anthony Fantano. He recommended her song Catalina. Catalina. I think it was... Bleak, and I fucking loved it. Um, and I want to check out her album, Los Angeles. Well, fucking hell, I'm fucking dusty cunt. The song's called Malamente. Would you like to start? Yes, I would like to start. Okay, I great. I swear I pressed record. Do you remember, do you remember I turned it on? Look, you're a bit of a loose unit, so I don't know what you're really doing <laughs> half the time. <laughs> Oh my Lucia! Fuck me, shut up, back up! Fuck me! <laughs> Rosalia, but that was fucking dope. The fucking. 
Bruh, just the way she used her vocals to the to the to the fucking clicks and the claps. The timing of and the, the lyrics. Oh, and the great. way she used her voice on the on the bridge at the end, like da -da 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 -da. Yeah. I was like, oh. Oh. The video was amazing too. Yeah, a lot of symbolism. Oh, the visuals, like the colors, the dancing was like simple and on point. That was fucking amazing. That was really fucking impressive. And this road, this track is quite different from one of her biggest tracks, Catalina, which I was introduced to. So she's already demonstrating some diversity within her musical talent. My Lamante. What? That's what it's called. How did she say it? My Lamante. Oh, you must have different ears. No, what'd she say? Malamente is oh. what I heard. Malamente. I'm not already Spanish. fucking up. Spanish people correct us if we're wrong. Uh, Malamente means badly apparently, according to Google Translate. Now, we saw that one of the biggest problems with these uh, reaction review channels that reviewed music from other countries in their non-native language is that they didn't look at the lyrics. We're gonna look at the lyrics because the lyrics is half the body of work. So we're gonna do that right now. We're going to, oh my God, he got a new flannel. What? Anthony Fantano, he's got an orange flannel. He's never worn an orange flannel before. Oh great, let's watch that. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on here? Orange flannel. This shirt, it's it's a it's a it's a color. I have no idea. My reality is falling apart. My world is crumbling. Hey everyone, Destiny Teeth Tanner here. Okay. Ante di casa e sala ya sabia kusi lompia esta papa di ando la lies dito se casando lo en o via ando la escalario en gian cos la do la pasilla. There's a lot of Spanish people. Oh wait, there's English on the other side. That helps. Oh, that's way better. <laughs> that broken crystallite, I felt how it crunched before falling to the ground. I already knew it was breaking. <clears throat> it is blinking, the light of the landing, a voice on the stairs, someone crossing the corridor. I fucked with that. So A lot to be uh, interpreted. Yeah, I don't know what that exactly means. Interpreted. We've got to make sure, like Google Translate is going to make mistakes sometimes with translations because mm. We, people use a lot of slang sometimes. And also a lot of languages have words that don't exist in other languages. Exactly. Um, that's a very good point. So that sounds like she's trying to symbolize and use metaphors to represent something deeper than what we understand it to be. Mm. And the hooks, she's just saying badly over and over again. Yeah. But it's so catchy. Mm, the malamente. Is. It's executed so well with that. Is that what badly means? Malamente? I mean, it's... According to Google Translate. Yeah. Now Spanish people might say something different. Is she saying that like basically you want her badly? Let's say that broken crystallite. <clears throat> I don't know. It might be talking about drugs. Um, because of the, what the video depicts. Oh, well, crystallite could be... Depends on how it crunched. Maybe it is about drugs. Well, look, let's go verse 2. Let's go verse oh, 2. Oh, actually... It's kind of as if... Well, it's kind of as if like she took drugs. And then basically the light of the landing, the voice and stairs. Maybe the drugs have taken effect. Well, yeah, we'll go to verse 2. The rare night is set... Oh, sorry, I'll let you read this one. That's fair. Oh, okay. The rare night is set. They have come out. They have, co they have come out, moon and stars. This gypsy girl told me better not to go out to see her. No, I dream that I'm walking for a bridge in the sidewalk. Look, look, look. The more I want to cross it, go. More moves and wobbles. It sounds like she's on drugs. And she's like depicting yeah. some like hallucinogen experience. And the chorus. So maybe when she's saying badly, badly, like maybe that's like saying... So the drugs talking? The drugs are bad, but then she wants it badly? I don't know. We might three, be way off. Oh, completely. But we'd be even more off if we didn't have fucking any translate. <laughs> I'd be like, yeah, how the fuck am I meant to know what? Sahe, what's the... So the, the hook's just malamente, malamente. Yeah. Uh, In the chorus. Even if it's not pretty, the night, undive. I'm going out on the street. In the little hand, the hoop shining. On my skin, the corals. Protect me and save me. Enlighten me and keep me. And ahead, I will not waste a minute thinking again. Yeah, there's not much to really for me to get from that one there, I'll be honest. But if we go the annotation here. Hmm. This song has symbology and references to the gypsy and Andalasian Andial culture. Malamente deals in general lines about the bad omen and how it can unleash other consequences in one's life, taking it to several vital areas. Oh, that actually helps a lot. Okay, so that's so what Badly's got to do is to do with gypsy culture. Hmm. Probably, yeah. What's on the... Maybe that has to do with the guy that was wearing like the purple like Ku Klux Klan like shit thing and that had the cross in the background when he was skating. And one of the skateboards had like nails on there. Oh, Andal... 
Yujin, or Andal Asian origin is like just Spanish. Mm. Represents a Spanish um, demographic. Intriguing. Okay, so they're talking about, you know, kind of the metaphysical, the, the things that we can't see in reality, the, the, the omens, the... Mm. Go ahead. No, I'm just, I'm just thinking, like, it's still hard for me to really put what we've translated to even into more words. Like, it's still left me to really interpret nearly everything she's saying. Because it's a, it's a concept. It's a complex theme. It's a concept. But, like, I feel like it's if I... what? I don't know. But I feel like even if I could speak Spanish, like, maybe I'd understand it better, but... Yeah. Anyway, uh, Spanish people, give us your interpretation of this music. I love Rosalie. If you want us to see uh, us review her album, Los Angeles, um, comment below. Uh, otherwise, comment below any other artists from different genres and countries around the world. Yeah, this is a new segment we're doing. We're hoping to do it once a week. Fuck. That's pretty frequent. No, it's not. Once a week's nothing at all. We're here once a week. Yeah, fucking one of these, fucking boom, you masturbate once a day, once a week's not hard. What if it's an album? Oh, then fuck that. There you go, that's what I'm referring we're just to. Doing, no, we're just doing singles, mate. We'll only do an album unless we, really we have like, like fucking 200,000 people saying, if you don't review this album, we'll cut off our testicles and sit mail them to you. Then we'll have like 200,000 fucking envelopes with testicles in them. We don't want that shit. Well, Jungle Beats... Um... You probably shouldn't be watching this video anymore, but... Um, no, no, you should, because... Subscribe. And please don't die. Wait. I'm not Fantana.